I feel very flattered, Banshee, but I doubt your husband would approve of this. <laughs> Who do you think sent me here, dear? He said you look terribly stressed lately, so we thought I should pay you a visit. I know just the thing to make you feel better, <clears throat> and it looks like you are ready for some stress relief. <clears throat> well, if you and Mr. Breeze think so, who am I to refuse your kind gesture? And it would be a horrible waste of a perfectly fine sandwich. Napa, I was looking for. <laughs> Oops, uh -huh. we didn't expect you, Vegeta. <laughs> I guess you have to call me dad now. <laughs> Are you kidding my mother in law? Yeah. Vegeta, what the? Oh my. Just what in the brief you fuck is going on? I've seen many timelines in my day on this channel. We've seen Vegeta in 18, Goku in Suno, and we've even seen Vegeta X Tsunade. But this takes the briefs in a whole new way. Panchi X Nappa? Is this a new ship that will take the fandom by storm? What would Raditz think about this if he could see it now? In this timeline, Vegeta and Nappa are friends and are alive and stay at the Briefs household. Where the fuck is Raditz? And just what will Bulma say when she finds out what her mom did behind her daddy's back? Is this an agreement? Is it really? I would like to think not. One thing that's been concluded in this entire video is the briefs are a bunch of hoes. And this is why these briefs deserve less. But to find out just what Panchi and Nappa were doing in between the sheets, there's only one way to find out. Only on Patreon today. Are you feeling angry, humiliated, is that it?